In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, disable the translation of titles, uh, descriptions, as well as automatic um, dubbing for the videos on YouTube. If you have a problem that automatically translates uh, the original title of the video to your language that's set on YouTube, um, like you can see right here, I have our channel opened and um, you can see the titles are not in English even though they were in English um, originally. Uh, to fix that issue, uh, there is um, a, an extension for Chrome and it'll, as far as I know, it works for, on, on Chrome. I don't really know if there are any other extensions for other browsers. So you can find that yourself, but on Chrome, uh, that I think is like most popular browser, um, you can get a special a uh, special one. So let's go to the Chrome Web Store. You'll just need to type in Chrome Web Store dot um, Google dot com in the Chrome browser and now search for YouTube Anti Translate. Uh, now you'll see this extension, this exact one. And um, yeah, you can see some before and after effects. Uh, that's pretty great. I don't really like these automatic dubbings and automatic video title translations. Uh, I just like to see it in the original state. So what I can do is click on add to Chrome, then click on add extension and it will be added. Now, once you click on it, you can see the status is cr currently enabled. You can disable it or enable it. Uh, then um, you can select what will be untranslated. The audio track, the description, channel branding, and uh, it will reload page automatically once you enable or disable it. Then in advanced options, there are a few things that you don't really need to change. And if I go to the YouTube, now, if I see uh, if the extension is on, it is. Let's refresh it. And yes, as you can see, all the videos are now in their original titles. And uh, once I click on any of those, then they will also have the original description and the, mm, <coughs> the dubbing will be set to the original. Of course, that can be changed manually, but mm, by default will be set to the original um, sound. And I hope that this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one.